and welcome to CSI Connect. I'm Kirosha Kumar. Today we're coming to you from Knowledge Commons where we're sitting down for a coffee chat with Dr. Kaveh Naidu, Group Executive of Business Excellence and Integration. Today we're having an exciting conversation on our upcoming 8th CSIR Biennial Conference taking place on the 2nd and 3rd of November 2022. Well, let's get started before our coffee gets cold. Dr. Naidu, welcome to the show and thank you so much for sitting with us today and talking about one of our biggest CSIR events yet. It's my pleasure, thank you very much. Let's talk about the CS theme which speaks directly to investing effort for a robust South African economy. How do you actually see that playing out at this year's conference? In line with the CSR ambition to make uh, existing industries more competitive and to create new enterprises, the CSR conference has three industry-oriented themes. The first one being the modernization of key industrial sectors through research, development and innovation. Those key industrial sectors being mining, manufacturing and agriculture. The second one focuses on new sources of growth, including uh, the likes of aquaculture, nanotechnology, space technology, hemp, pharmaceuticals manufacturing technology, and blockchain. The third one being um, showcasing our extensive commercialization portfolio, which looks at providing opportunities for existing industries to take commercially ready technologies to the market and for new enterprises to enter the market. That sounds really interesting. Dr. Naidu, what can people expect from this year's conference, keeping in mind the purpose and the significance? We have an amazing program lined up uh, with cutting edge content in a world class facility, the CSR International Convention Center. The projects being showcased uh, all aim to either support the competitiveness of industry or to support the capable state. In addition to the industry-oriented themes we had mentioned earlier, we are also showcasing a number of projects in support of capable state. For example, the circular economy, ICT for education and health, uh, open data for economic growth, precision medicine, and public transport. So Kirosha, those who attend, can also have the privilege of visiting a number of our facilities. For example, the Biomanufacturing Industry Development Center, the Nanotechnology Center, and the PV testing facility. Thank you for that, Dr. Naidu. That's really insightful. Now let's talk about who should be attending this conference and why. So Team CSR is on a mission. On a mission to make a difference, on a mission to touch lives through research, development and innovation. And we don't do this alone. We do this with our partners, with our customers, with our stakeholders. So we welcome all our partners, stakeholders, customers that have been part of this journey for the last two years. We're also keen to invite anyone willing to partner with us on this journey to make a difference. And last but not least, anyone who has a keen interest in getting a deeper insight as to what the CSR does and to experience the amazing work that our team uh, undertakes, we'd encourage all of them to visit. So we hope to see them there. Great. I can definitely see that playing out. Dr. Naidu, on a personal note, what are you most looking forward to seeing at the CS conference? This year's conference represents a first in-person event for a very long time. So I'm really looking forward to the chemistry that comes about with people meeting in the same space, people thinking together, and the new ideas and new opportunities for collaboration that, that will come out of this conference. Thank you very much for your time, Dr. Naira, and for this conversation. No doubt this conference is going to be one of excellence. Don't you agree? Absolutely agree. I'm really excited and looking forward to it. We'll see you there. Yes, I'll see you there too. The CSR conference for 2022 is just a matter of weeks away and we are looking forward to hosting you. Don't forget to register. From today's conversation, you can gather that it will indeed be robust and engaging and your participation will no doubt add value to that. On that note, we'd like to thank our guest Dr. Naidu for joining us and to you for watching.